Unkai Terrace at the Tomamo Resort in Hokkaido, Japan. At the Tomamo Resort, when it's not snowing, you can take the cable car up to the top of the mountain for the scenic view. They say there's supposed to be a cloud terrace up there. There are clouds. We're not sure whether it'll actually get us above the clouds or not. So we'll take a look once we get to the top. 1800 yen, uh, about $23. So not cheap, but only in Hokkaido can you take one of these cable cars. The ropeway travels a length of 2.4 kilometers, and it's a pretty interesting ride because the higher up you go, the higher into the clouds it gets, and the foggier it gets. The total ride up is just about 10 minutes from the bottom to the top. And the cloud forecast is cloudy. Today the terrace is in the clouds, but the good deal is when you pay your admission, they give you a postcard that shows you what it would look like if the terrace was above the clouds. Now, the thing to note is that the cable car only runs early in the morning. Topher, what time did we get up today? 5 a.m. 5 a.m. And we're late. It starts running today at 4.10 a.m. to 8 a.m. Are you ready for a good hike now on your five hours of sleep last night? Whee. Because when it's cloudy, that's what's left to do up here. Go for a nice hike. And it's kind of a cool weather because it's 14 degrees Celsius here and it was 27 degrees in Sapporo yesterday. So good temperature for hiking. Let's go. On the hiking trail, there are some little benches that you can rest on and some neat lookouts that you can look out above the clouds or today into the clouds. If you've ever wondered what it feels like to be inside of a cloud, this is about it. You can also have the opportunity to feel what it's like to dine inside of a cloud at the terrace next to the top of the ropeway. Uh, there is a Tokyo soup stock where you can get a bowl of pretty tasty soup for 610 yen or about $8. And they also sell tea. And if you're wondering how much a cup of tea is here, 450 yen, so about six bucks. But I guess it's worth it for the view. And off to the side of the terrace is also a Japan Mail post box, where the postcard that comes with admission uh, can be mailed for free anywhere in the world via airmail. Pretty neat. After enjoying the view, having some soup, and mailing the postcard, there's not much left to do except head on back down. And the ride down is a pretty neat view, especially uh, as it clears and you get a view of the Tomamu Valley. It's an especially neat perspective of the tower hotels, which are some very interesting feats of modern architecture. If you're planning a trip to Tomamu, make sure to check out my Tomamu travel guide over there on the right.